An incredible video is going viral after a woman checked her mail. As it turns out, she happened to get a letter from the Department of Social Services about her welfare application, and when she saw what it said, she completely freaked out. Footage of a woman reacting to a welfare application response from the Department of Social Services is going viral. Apparently, she had been waiting for this letter for a very long time and was extremely giddy after finally having it in her hands. In the video, the woman excitedly rushes into her house after receiving the welfare letter in the mail. Practically skipping along to get inside, she makes her way to the couch, rips open the envelope, and begins to read the letter. Unfortunately for her, it seems that money isn't her only struggle. She apparently has trouble in the reading comprehension department as well. Initially, she can't quite comprehend what the letter means when it says that she is fully favorable and pushes her children out of the way as she tries to figure it out. After asking everyone in the room for help cracking the code, she continues reading the letter in search of any clues about what it actually meant. Eventually, she realizes she is being informed that she was approved to receive welfare benefits, and her reaction is as though she won the lottery. The woman screams and shouts, wildly stomping her feet and making her excitement known. The news must have been long awaited. Multiple family members had their cell phones out to record the big reveal. The letter says that her claim dates back a few years, which likely means that she will be receiving retroactive benefits from the time she originally applied. The video is being called outrageous and is quickly spreading around social media. Watch her reaction for yourself. After viewers realized that she was awarded a non-disability claim, it seemed to anger people who identified themselves as hard-working taxpayers. Some were concerned that she would only get fatter and have no motivation to get off of welfare. Others suggested the couch she was excitedly bouncing on should get disability. Overall, they weren't very kind with their comments on social media. Deborah Davis thought the family looked like white trash, as if the couch in the front yard wasn't a dead giveaway there was trash living in there. No doubt it died the same horrible death that the couch she is on right now. It was a good idea to put it on YouTube so every working taxpayer gets to see what garbage we are supporting. Joe Tuna expressed his dislike of the welfare system and its potential for abuse. So when you have a crippling disease, you must fight for SSI for five or six years and get no income, but she gets paid for what? She didn't seem to be crippled, had a lot of energy, enough to work, and already has enough money to eat far more than her share. Jill Last suggested that authorities should watch the video and reevaluate their process. SSI really needs to watch this video. This is what every hardworking paycheck goes to. Lazy people living in their own trash. From the moment she shredded the envelope and threw the pieces on the floor, I knew she was going to be a piece of work. Donald Wood said that people should not want more out of life than this. A lifestyle that consists of trips to Walmart, McDonald's, and the liquor store. What did you want more out of life? I work hard to be able to afford to go to concerts, sporting events, vacations, etc. It seems like a no-brainer to me. Work hard and reap the benefits. Not just catch the drippings of society like a dog. Most people genuinely want to help those who are truly in need. But does this woman fit the description? The majority of commenters didn't seem to think so, but perhaps the video doesn't tell us all we need to know to make a fair determination. However, she did seem to be able to move pretty well to retrieve that letter.